Lawmakers are considering a bill that strips judicial discretion in some family cases involving kids and gender-based treatments. Two New State House reporter Jason Aubrey is asking questions of people on both sides of the issue. This all came about after a judge in Hamilton County gave custody of a teenage girl to their grandparents after the parents refused to allow the child to get hormone treatments to outwardly identify as a boy. Back in February, Citizens for Community Values rallied against the court ruling in Hamilton County. Aaron Bayer talked to me via Skype about the new bill here at the State House. This is about ensuring parents are the ones in charge of their child's upbringing. Not the state, not anybody else. Bayer says the bill protects the family unit and compares it to the situation on the border with the separation of families. Children being with their moms and dads matters so much. And so we should be, the state should be very hesitant to interject themselves into that relationship. But Equality Ohio calls it the latest attempt by anti LGBTQ extremists targeting transgender youth. This isn't about tearing apart families, it's about making sure that children receive the sometimes life saving health care that they need and that their doctors believe that they need. She's not talking about the hormone treatments that Bayer and his group are upset about from the Hamilton court case. She's talking about mental health care for kids ready to give up. We know that young people who are transgender or gender nonconforming are at increased risk for both suicide and self-harm and at, are at much greater risk than our other children in society. At the State House, Jason Aubrey, 2 News, working for you.